Whoa. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> oh, <laughs> it's, li it's literally if Sukuna fucking took over two mad bodies. Oh my god! <laughs> Happy thanks for the follow. Hi YouTube. Yes, hi YouTube. Jesus Christ. That's a jump scare for sure. Oi. You know, you should let me know if you think Ghetto is sexy too, because it's really disappointing that I find him very attractive. Huh? She finds it disappointing that she finds Goro attractive? Did I understand that correctly? Oi. You know, you should let me know if you think Ghetto is sexy too, because it's really disappointing. Is she calling him Ghetto? I find him very attractive. Ghetto? Oh, 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 she's talking about the other guy. Never oh, mind. So, if you don't know what Jujutsu Kaisen is, to Never put it into it. simple words, it is the successor to My Hero Academia. <laughs> <laughs> In terms of the community being god awful, brain rotted, and get. I. Have you ever actually heard anything about the Jujutsu Kaisen uh, fandom? Honestly, this, this is my. A very minimal amount. Yeah, this is my first experience with it now. Uh, like, we watched all of it. We watched the movie and we watched the two seasons, so yeah. Like, what the fuck is this? Full hard on for fictional characters. I'm talking full mast, as due to so, the now. What? What? Did, what for the fuck fictional did say? characters. I'm talking full mast. The main expert, my hoo ha. <laughs> hey. As due to the now ending of My Hero Academia in yeah. the manga, at least, which, not to spoil anything, was absolutely terrible. My dude actually got cooked so hard. That's cooked uh, means C U C K E D. His ghost will have a place in all the famous hotel cook chairs. As just reading it made me feel like guts in that one infamous part of Berserk. Like I can quite. What's the infamous part of Berserk? The one where they deleted all of his Pokemon save files. The horse scene. <laughs> That's the only scene I know! Never really watched Berserk, don't ask. Save yourself from that, please. It's not the horse scene, okay. Oh boy. Is it worse? It is the eclipse. What's the eclipse? I told you, they deleted all of his Pokemon save files. Confidently oh say, I spent half of my life following that series just to be significantly disappointed. But as my academia now comes to a close, Jujutsu Kaisen now attains the crown of the cringiest community for an ongoing anime. And I is Jojo still ongoing, or is Jojo finished? I think it's finished. Yeah. Also, yeah, an anime-wise, they're, they're taking a sweet time with the next part. Well, that's not finished, is it? It's ongoing? Okay. Well, that case is the JoJo uh, fandom I'm talking cringe about too. Example, the video I did on My Academia and its community, the number one comment was that YouTube is, is significantly worse. And I don't want to talk about femboys or VTubers for a bit, so we're going to be oh, talking about Tiger. this today. Oh. So which one is more cringier, the My Hero Academia community or the Jujutsu the Kaisen community? Uh, here, here chat, now, here, I've here's Now I've watched season Gojo. 1 and season 2 of Jujutsu okay. Kaisen, and overall it's Hopefully the anime. movie as well. My favourite part is where Nanami beats the absolute shit. Out of oh, Haruta. Yeah. Only yeah, 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 yeah. That was one of the best parts for sure. Yep, yep, satisfying. I find that that scene has been sexualized. Of <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> All right, we're done. <laughs> Million times over now. But for those of you who don't know what a Jujutsu Kaisen is, basically just a nice <laughs> <little> <laughs> supernatural series, but with high schoolers. No! <laughs> no! And so much flashing no, soul no. make an epileptic kid flop like a fish. 
But basically, Jujutsu Kaisen is about the main character, Yuji, discovering this whole new world of sorcery by accidentally swallowing a finger of one of the most powerful curses and actually becomes a host for it, where most people would have probably died. Oh, there he is. From there, it's planned he will join this sorcery world, eat all the fingers, and so the probably get executed you. to rid the world of this curse once and for all. That is the basic premise where I don't spoil anything, but honestly, the anime sure, is yeah. pretty good, and the manga it is, is good. It is! Oh my god! <laughs> animation of the scene. As well. But understandably, the Bro. anime got pretty popular, especially upon the release of the second season, where you definitely had an increase in the popularity of it. But when an anime reaches that <laughs> level of popularity, like I said in my previous video... Oh, what the fuck is this? Okay, that's more Bro! cursed than the... Bro, that's a more powerful curse than Sukuna, fuck off. Oh my god. You get the 1% of the total fans, whereas other fans would just sit down and watch the anime, maybe change their Discord profile and uh, their phone yeah. case. No, but sure. then you get the 1% oh my god. that likes to... That profile picture hurts. Hey yo, Sukuna though. <laughs> I love that. I love for this anime on a much wider <laughs> scale, and that's not such a bad thing. You have people like cosplay, maybe oh, that's attractive mm -hmm. in the Much wider scale, and that's not such a <laughs> bad thing. You have people. Yeah, like nah. -uh. And down, I... original is way hotter. Yep, one hundred percent. Like cosplay, make memes about it, and edits about the anime. All that is fine, but then you get the people that take it too seriously. And that 1% stat. What did that tweet fine, say? But then you get the people that take it too seriously. Watching this, this with one hand? Nah, bro, what the fuck? No! And that 1% starts to represent the whole community. We saw the same thing with My Hero Academia. But on a more rampant scale. Oh, what the fuck? Um, Udoroki giving birth in 8K? Excuse you, what? I didn't know I needed bleach for this. We had people shipping characters that. No, 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 they did never not. Never been in the same they... room. No, no. no. Shared the same interests. No, are you for real? Well, characters these, that had never been in the same I'm pretty room sure in the green zone, the considering the legality. What the fuck is this? Interests, um, or had a single second. What? Why? Kind of eye contact, or even sometimes have about 20 years age difference. I, However, Jujutsu Kaisen I need doesn't bleach. have this problem. At least not on the scale of My Hero Academia, because there are only a few characters affected by this. And one main one, which has had most of them salivating at the mouth ever since they made their appearance in the anime. And that character is Gojo. I mean, can you blame people? Can you blame oh, people? <laughs> look at that! Look at that! It seems like this character has been able to capture the many hearts of many men and women. <laughs> to the point where you have some people saying him as their preference or bar for dating. IRL people no. are being compared to a fictional anime character, okay. subsequently losing to said standard. Date any person that did not have a hole blown through their head and became insane after. Yeah, man. <laughs> Came here to see how many women Goja has stolen from me. You know, I liked it when girls had the preference for dating someone like Levi Ackerman. That was easy to beat, but the Gojo fangirls <laughs> are probably the most common <laughs> feature of the community, just for how down bad they are. Under any Gojo edit, it's like the Sahara Desert. I can't walk, I can feel tears dropping down my legs, gosh. Disgusting. What the fuck, man? What the fuck? With how parched and back. these people are, it gives off similar energy of it's not winter or Christmas, but I'm gonna jingle his belts for that snow! <laughs> what? What? <laughs> the Bakugo and Midoriya fangirls that would have literally done a satanic ritual just to see these two kiss. But the Jujutsu Kaisen fans would probably do that just to smell the same surroundings as him. But it's not just Gojo affected by this, it's also my favourite character. Oh was my favourite character, if you catch my drift. 
But they did Nanami wrong as well. They infected <laughs> no, my mean... boy with horniness. The scene where he's absolutely <laughs> pummeling that femboy. Especially when he's pulling I mean... his hair. I like, mean... They did that on purpose. Like, 100% fucking Mappa did this on purpose. Like, you can't tell me Mappa did not know what they were doing. He's the IRS and no, he just found out he missed a dollar in the people in the animation studio were working overtime. Probably 15 <laughs> died in the fucking cause. Like, some people are losing their shit over this. Nanami came on my screen and so did I, hey, yo! This as well. Like, I understand, you know, if somebody pulled you by your ponytail, like, it, it sounds pretty hot, but please leave out the TikTok comments. When is it going to be my turn? It's twitching help. I know the adversary people are looking at me while I'm fangirling in my car at the parking lot. Girl, what do you mean by fangirling in my car? <laughs> We don't need to know how moist you are. Full back arcing and toe curling. Bro, ew! Oh, like this is some down battery that <gasps> Why I've post this on the before. internet? In terms of people recreating this at a convention. Does he really need to sh show this scene over and over again? You know, it's fine. Just make sure people know you're going to do that. And I know people have been commenting on these videos like, these people are in the middle ages and doing this. Adults, by the way, why is no one hating these grown people, bro? No one's hating because they're all too busy doing something else. <laughs> That's why. <laughs> Are these people, like, too old to be doing this? Yeah, when they recreate it, cons it as a horny... Shut up! That's too, I guess. But at least they are recreating something that happened in the anime. Not whatever the My Hero Academia fans were doing True. at conventions. True, can true, true. What the fuck is that? Jutsu Kaisen fans are very much down bad. Now, the memes. The, the memes, memes from the My Hero Academia community was very much similar to waterboarding. But the Jujutsu Kaisen community did something different. I was they Danny DeVito doing the waterboarding. With... <laughs> I don't know. Brain That's rock. the one question the I have. The mention of here. mewing, skibbity, uh, that oh. I used very much in all of the memes. And you can very much feel your brain eroding watching some of these meme compilations. Dude, what are you even talking about? I don't even like girls. I have a boyfriend. It's kind of gay, Gojo. <laughs> oh. You want <laughs> that? But that's part of it. There's a reason <laughs> why they call this lobotomy kaizen. What, Many what? of these memes are meant to make you feel the like crit. you should have been unplugged from the life support about- <laughs> What is that? Where do I buy it? Honestly, where do I buy it? Many of these memes are meant to make you feel like you should have been unplugged- <laughs> I need it. I need it so bad. Fucking Oreo! ...from the life support about 10 years ago because you are physically- <laughs> Brain dead. What you doing there, pal? Shit, Sukuna, I think I'm cooked. <laughs> Alright, Gojo. Well, I'm gonna let you get your ass beat because of that one time you switched out my party balloon with a condom. Have fun. Uh, like hold up. <laughs> right. Okay. Deciphering some of these memes actually hurt my brain. <laughs> and the most profound reason for this is it's meant to. Most of the time, it's not even meant to make you laugh. Nah, I'd the fuck off. It is there just to reduce your brain. I woke up and got fresh as hell on a Monday. Okay, yeah, that one Cells certainly one by is confusing one. my brain. <laughs> okay. <laughs> one by one. Okay, that one made me laugh. But there's one meme that stuck out and was applied almost everywhere, and that would be the Nah, I'd win meme. That's Not true, that was Not only was this everywhere. meme used to spoil oh, an entire geez. arc of Jujutsu Kaisen, but it also maybe never happened. Due to one of the agencies ah! translating, making an error, yeah, it, and thus uh, Nah, I'd win error. was born from the English translation. He was just saying no. Nah, I'd win. Honestly, first time... The translation actually did something good. And people just applied this. Oh my god, that was Peter. That was... Did you see Peter? <laughs> did you see Peter? There's no way you didn't see the one nah, before. Nah, Win was born no, from didn't. the English translation. Peter's the first one, see? It's right, go next. Go next. 
People just applied this everywhere. It was rampant on the internet. We even have an edit for the earth saying, nah, I win. When God created the universe, he asked his favorite planet. Out of all the stars I just created, who would win? Them or you? Nah, I'd win. Because throughout the Milky Way and the solar system, I alone am the habitable one. But a lot of people have actually put a lot of effort into, a into the YouTube meme. Kaizen memes. You have people promoting drinking and driving, as you do. And ah! child endangerment, my favorite. Oh. Wait, wait, what is me and bro hitting the most diabolical evil combo in a Roblox fighting game on an innocent eight year old? An eight year old <laughs> will never recover. <laughs> oh my no. Even oh my the VR chat community making really well edited and engaging content, that's good. They at least stepped away from the mirror to actually make that video. But there's always one side of the community that takes the memes a bit too seriously, or just misses the beat altogether. Like, some of these are the equivalent of your mother posting on Facebook some with a Minions meme with impact text on it. And then you have some of these which are basically like a 13 year old going through their first breakup because their crush chose to sit next to George on the playground and that just broke their itty bitty heart. But they are Unlucky. miles better than anything produced from the Myra Academia community. Chat, I need to move to the left for you guys to see this brain e -E rot. But they are miles better than anything produced from the Myra Academia community. Those what? guys took that anime to a whole different level. Like it was the Harry yeah. Potter Why? fandom all over again. Why are all the delicate Rocco band, like Shoto fucking cosplayers all underage girls? Yeah, I don't know. That is, that is just house, a whole Your next... punishment would be 10 yeah. days in Syria or something. But the last thing I wanted to talk about was the toxicity. Mild. Now, the Jujutsu Kaisen fandom in terms of toxicity basically boils down to people trying to spoil the anime from the manga, especially one event which oh made people God. very upset and resulted. Me when I accidentally got spoiled by Gar because he was talking about a meme of Jujutsu wow. Kaisen. Like, he literally, like, asked me, Yo, you know Jujutsu Kaisen, right? And I was like, yeah. And I wanted to say, but don't say anything about the manga. And he already proceeded talking. Shout out to Gar. <laughs> <laughs> the pain! Played in a character dying, which in and of itself caused the author of the manga to receive death threats. Jujutsu Kaisen Manga Kagege Akutami gets death threats and head comments for killing off blank. I I I I I think I know which one this is. I, I think this is the Gar spoiler. I think this is the Gar spoiler. Oh boy. But also Ma, the thing like, just say, like people we've saying already had in the anime very, very liked characters being killed off right before they were more liked than ever because of certain scenes. <laughs> We've already had that, and honestly, I like, mean, if people don't expect it from that point onwards, I, I'm just gonna say, uh... That is true. Like, Giga doesn't shy stupid. away. Like, Giga doesn't this, shy this away is, from fucking killing this, this, this is, this is like Game of Thrones, like, type of fucking show right here, where they just uh, kill off anyone in a fucking roulette spin wheel and then laugh at it as well. Giga is a fucking madman. And Gojo is the best character, and he solos all over anime characters, and people <laughs> actively debating if... Gojo can beat fucking Kakarot. And in the event someone fucks. says Jujutsu. The fucks. Now, what Kakarot stage are we talking about? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, oh, chat, what do you say? Goku versus uh, Gojo, who wins? Goku after Super Saiyan Blue? Uh, yeah, beats the shit out of Gojo. Goku, Gojo gets cleaned by Super Saiyan Goku, base Kakarot Club Gojo, Cosmic Saitama wins. <laughs> Real. Gojo. Nah, I do it. <laughs> Gojo bench press a planet. <laughs> Goku. Can we just talk about how fucking re Yeah, how fucking ridiculous. <laughs> the Ooh, fucking... The 
a fucking um, power scaling and a fucking drag mollus though. There's absolutely no plot to it. They just keep coming back stronger and stronger. It's just so stupid. Hey, hey, it used to be whoever has the more quirky hair color wins. <laughs> now, apparently, whoever changes no. skin color first wins. It used to be how long your hair is and what, what do you mean? Oh, okay, <laughs> that's the very beginning, that's true. Uh, and then Super Google Saiyan God Go came Go. out, and then it went downhill. First appearance, Vegeta already blew up planets, meaning everyone on Namek could do that too. Oh my god. Yes. Goku was Super Saiyan, God Super Saiyan. Yeah, like, the power scaling in Dragon Ball is just so fucking ridiculous, I can't. Let's just ignore the fact that at all times, uh, Frieza was able to blow up Earth during any fight with ease, and uh, for some reason they can't, like, do a lethal blow to one, to not, one another. You know? That's, yeah, that's a yeah, very interesting, let's ignore that. That's a very interesting thing uh, there, yeah. Get my hairstyle for the win. <laughs> oh boy, JJK is more popular, but Bleach clears JJK is mid. Hey, a lot of people say hey, hey, that JJK is mid, but I, I disagree. I like it. I like it a lot. Fuck everyone who like says it it's mid. Well. <laughs> However, Bleach Thousand Year uh, Blood War is uh, pretty nah, good. Nah, it has its inconsistency and in, like story. Like, it's, it's good. The animation is awesome. I liked it. But it has its plot you holes. Your forehead has inconsistencies. It has... It doesn't. Fuck you. It has inconsistencies. I would say JJK is better than Bleach. I mean, as a whole, yes. Yeah. Like, JJK... Nah, JJK clears Bleach. Not Bleach clears JJK, man. Two Kaisen is mid. Death threats are soon to follow, but that's basically what the toxicity in the community boils down to. Other than saying it's the best anime compared to other animes, oh, but the me. toxicity level is still significant. What the fuck is that? ...be better than yes. My Academia. As the same thing happened with My Academia, where they sent death threats to the creator because some of them wanted their canon ship to become true. Bro! And I thought VTuber fans are parasocial. What the fuck? What the I, fuck? I've seen someone reply to one of these people <coughs> on a uh, Reddit yeah. comment and essentially it boiled down to please get laid. And I'm just sitting here like we both know that's never happening. Like when they were replying to one of these people like sending death threats over their ships not happening. And if they didn't display a panel correctly oh, in the anime from the manga, more death threats. And some yep. would quite literally go to war to make sure their ship was the best. Um. Yeah, I'm, I'm just quite happy that I stay away from fandoms. In all yeah. honesty, I'm, I'm quite happy that I stay in my own little bubble. <laughs> and there are some the the show. Which are... What? I just enjoy the show, is that so wrong? Literally go to war to make sure their ship was the best. And there are some ships which are borderline disgusting, like Deku X. What? No! Deku <laughs> oh my. I've seen this so much. I hate that I've seen this so much. That's like some, like, um, what's this the is fucking... the uh, Boku no Pico edit. What, what's the like really, really controversial, controversial like uh, artist called Shadbase? Yeah, that, that's that type of oh, shit right here. Oh, fuck that guy. Yeah, it's that type of garbage right here. I'm, I'm happy that I've never seen Boku no Pico, man. I'm so happy I'm... that I've never went down that route. Bro, that shit's disgusting. Harry is like 10 years old. So in conclusion, yeah. Se didn't it say seven? seven. Yeah. Seven. Harry is like overshot 10 it years old. Mile. So in yeah. conclusion, yes, My Academia is a lot worse in terms of community, but the Jujutsu Kaisen community is still in its infant phase, compared to My Academia at this time. It's getting way worse. Normalize posting cringy drafts from 2020, what? Bro, just, if you want to be cringy, just be cringy. I became a VTuber. I, like, literally, just, just be cringy. 
Nobody cares. Just just do it. Time, it was a lot more tame. But, like, so as my academia slowly winds down, do illegal I shit. think Jujutsu Kaisen will be able to take that crown for the for most lot. toxic or just yeah, generally so. worst community. Because it's always that 1% that will represent the whole community. So if you're one of those people that just enjoy watching the anime, good for you. You don't belong in a straight jacket. And if you actually want to avoid spoilers and just the toxicity in general from an anime community, do not go on social media. It will spoil everything about the that anime or manga. Just like how I got spoiled about how one of the characters dies in Jujutsu Kaisen. Don't worry, I'm not that much of an asshole to actually spoil it. But yeah, I just... And before he spots it in the very last millisecond, man. I wanted to make a silly little video today because I've been Single talking about frame. fanboys and other YouTubers and VTubers a lot lately. So I thought I'd finally put the comments to bed about the My Academia and the Jujutsu Kaisen community. But yeah, bye bye Oh boy. Oh, boy. The internet was a mistake. <laughs> no, it wasn't. We wouldn't be here if it was. Yeah, what well, was a mistake is letting social media like just go pass by unmoderated from people that clearly need several lobotomies to be fucking able to socially fucking connect with others. That was a mistake. Yeah. Why did we give these people a voice? Normalize getting lobotomized. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Bring it back, honestly. I miss it. <laughs> Bring back the bottom face. <laughs> I need to bleach my eyes, though, and lobotomize my brain. I'm right there with you. Bottomize my eyes and bleach my brain. Yeah. And for Doesn't the YouTube pods, there's a legend. <laughs> I hate this part. I get so awkward. I hate this. I, I wanna hide. My anxiety is acting up. Ah!